What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. It is a new release day. It's 2020 Panini Absolute Football Day. Six box inner case break. Random teams number one just sold out. So again, it also is an early bird break. So buy one of the first 18 spots in the break to get entered to win a free spot. 32 spots. All teams in. All card ship. And reiterate again, all card ship. <laughs> you get uh, three autographs. One rookie premier materials autograph. Uh, two additional autos per box. Two memorabilia cards. Uh, one insert, two parallels, and one rookie. And there you go. So here's the dice roller. Here's the customer that made the early bird cutoff from Oliver Smith down to Patrick. And then you have the customers here. So we'll paste. We'll paste the customer. I don't know why the asterisk is right there, but we'll paste the customer name that wins right there, and that'll make it 32. And here's all the teams in. So let's use the dice roller. Boom. And we got ourselves a one and a four, <clears throat> five times. Good luck. <clears throat> Number one gets a free spot. One, two, three, four, five. Boom, five times. Wesley, Thomas, congratulations. Free spot for you. Get a little plus sign. And five times now here on the team, on names and teams for the break. One. Two, three, four, and five. Tony and numero uno down to Ryan. All right, five. Another one, five teams now. One, two, three, four, five. Chiefs down to the Cardinals. All right, so Tony, you have the Chiefs, Kang with the Bears, Oliver Smith with the Steelers, Natalie, you have the Saints, Jason with the Colts, Eric with the Browns, Danny, you have the Bucks, Sean with the Rams, Ryan with the Broncos, Wesley with the Panthers, Patrick with the Seahawks, Tony with my Eagles, Natalie with the Bills, Ryan, last one, Mojo Vikings, Wesley, your free spot with the Giants, John with the Cowboys, Corey with the Titans, Danny, you have the 49ers, John with the uh, Washington football team, Rich, you have the Texans, Ryan Redman with the pa Packers, Danny with the Dolphins. Christopher with the Chargers, Rob with the Raiders, Rich with the Falcons, Barry with the Jaguars, Christopher with the Lions and Patriots, Ryan with the Ravens, Danny have the Bengals, William with the Jets, and Ryan with the Arizona Cardinals. Alright, so if anybody wants to trade, there you go. Give you guys a quick minute. I'm gonna open up the case over here, guys, just because it's actually gonna hit the monitors right in front of the screen. So I'm gonna quickly open it. We are actually this way. So there's two inner cases of six boxes each in here. Alright, absolutely. Which one we'll use here? A little dice roll. I guess I can actually break this over here now. Do this one. Yeah, All right. Does anybody want to trade, guys? Matthew takes the Orioles in triple threats, so that means we're down to three left now. So just the Tigers, Dodgers, and Cardinals. Right, I'm assuming nobody wants to trade, right? So let's close it. I know it's early, guys, but it's going to be a busy day today, so good to get some of these breaks knocked out early. Go. 
All right, guys. So again, like always, inner case break. One, two, three, four, five, six. And it was a five. So one, two, three, four, five, six. This would be used for absolute random teams number two. Hey, TJ, happy, happy new release day, man. And happy Wednesday. Absolute boxes look pretty cool this time. Like, they look like, uh... Like, more artistic. And I love that they're advertising the Kaboom a lot more, because that is a very popular insert. So, I'm actually pretty curious who is part of the Kabooms this year. Let's take a quick look before I start. Delays. Um, yeah, I do. There's a lot of them, actually. Thanks. So... Tom Brady will be Kaboom number one. Um, I would assume so, TJ. I don't. I don't think we wouldn't do any more random teams, but uh, maybe we'll wait to confirm with Nick. I'm assuming we would. I mean, it's very popular doing that random team style, especially triple threats. But if anything, if you want to wait on it just a little bit. Um, but I, I expect it. I don't. I don't know. So, yeah, Tom Brady is number one, card number one. You have Patty Mahomes as card number two. Lamar Jackson's three. Aaron Rodgers, four. Rob Gronkowski's five. George Kittle. You have Troy Polamalu. Dak Prescott. Christian McCaffrey. Kyler Murray's a kaboom. Teddy Bridgewater. Tyreek Hill. Russell Wilson. Uh, another one for the Chiefs. Uh, Derek Thomas. Drew Brees. Paint Manning, Colts edition, Derrick Henry, Delvin Cook, Carson Wentz is a kaboom for the Eagles. Uh, you have Daniel Jones, TJ Watt, Drew Locke, Dan Marino, Adrian Peterson, uh, another Larry Fitzgerald, I guess. Or did I say Larry Fitzgerald? I don't know if I did. Gardner Minch was one, Matt Ryan, Matthew Stafford. There's like two Joe Burrow kabooms, so there must be like a variation. There's two, two Herberts. There's a Jalen Hurts for my Eagles. Pretty much all the top rookies. So you have Burrow, Tua, Justin, Jordan Love, Jalen Hurts, C.D. Lamb, Henry Ruggs, Clyde edwards Elaire. Yeah, and Jerry Judy with Chase Young. So pretty much the top rookies have a kaboom. And then you have pretty much the more Hall of Fame slash like great veterans that are, that are already in the NFL right now currently. So yeah, there's a lot of kabooms for sure. Love to pull one. That'd be nice. Now right, we got Mark Ingram. To 75. Jared Stidham to 35. Tools of the Trade autograph. There you go. Not too bad. Patriots with that one. And we have DeAndre Swift, little three color patch. To 49. 
Troy Lyons going to Christopher. We have Deontay Johnson to 99. Little two color or er, two double relic and auto. Steelers with that one. I know, no Donovan McNabb, D Porter, but it's okay though. I'm pretty much almost done with my my uh, rainbow for Miles and McNabb, so I'm happy. That's what I really want. I'm more into color at the end of the day. Kabooms are cool, though, but I'm more into the color, like prisms and stuff like that. But I had to have mosaic. I just I had to. And look at that, a little low number base, three out of five, Hulk Matt. That's nice. Bears. It's going to Kang. Alright, so there's one box or actually not sorry. We got one pack. You got Philip Lindsay to 100. DeAndre Hopkins, Khalil Mack, and Neil Smith. Autograph to 49 for the Chiefs going to Tony. Most popular Eagle? I'd probably say like, I don't know, Brian Dawkins maybe? I mean, you know, everybody loves Randall and and Red and and Reggie and stuff like that. But I'd have to say I'd have to say B Docs just because he's a Hall of Famer now. But Randall was very popular. Like, I mean, to this day, he still is very popular. But I, I would probably say Brian Dawkins. Mark Wahlberg, yeah, you know when he played uh, Vince Papali. You know Vince Papali, they made a movie of him, so. Actually, you now, you know, I mean, when you win a Super Bowl for the Eagles, right, your first one ever, you got to think it's uh, Nick Foles, right? So Carson Wentz. Justin Herbert. Woo. Man, I'm just a Herbert magnet. Who has the Chargers? Christopher. Very nice. Kurt. Oh, yeah, that's right, Kurt. What's going on, man? Uh, so basically, this is a group break inside, meaning that we break open a a box or a case of cards, and we sell the teams via you know pick your team or random team. Instagram is just straight up personal boxes, meaning the whole customer gets the whole box. Everybody that has a spot in here paid a fixed price, got randomized a random team, and basically, if like Christopher, I hit on that Chargers Justin Herbert right now. Christopher keeps the Herbert because he has the Chargers. So, Instagram is straight up just for personal boxes, meaning you get the whole box, you pay for it. This one, everybody's paying a fraction and getting a team out of a whole case. Yes. So, yeah, if you bought into that hockey case break, yes, it'll be here later today. Down to 16. I'd love to do that. I'd love me some hockey. Um, but, yeah, it most likely will be breaking here. So, you kind of have to stock the website a little bit to see when it's sold out also nightbot does help us out he drops the break schedule link all the time and we're actively updating that um actively updating that as breaks sell out so there's no schedule breaks um you know just when it fills it breaks but it should break at some point today jordan brooks to 50 and 
and we have little Heinz Ward relic. The rookie, yeah. I mean, you know, Invincible is a pretty. That's pretty cool, though, man. I mean, the fact is that the Eagles were so bad, so bad in the '70s that they had an open tryout for locals. To potentially get a roster spot with Dick Vermeil coming from UCLA. <laughs> and a dude actually was running like a 4 6 in the combine there for them. And he was a former bartender and just got to play with the Eagles. I mean, that's pretty cool. He was actually a part of that Super Bowl team that lost to the Raiders. Raekwon Davis. It's actually a pretty cool story. I mean, I love Rudy and stuff like that. But. I mean, that one was pretty cool. Yeah, well, they have, like, walk-ons, right? For, like, college. It's kind of hard to do walk-ons for the NFL now, but... That's right, AJ. That's right. Yeah, he does the late night, so he comes in a little bit later. You know? Uh, right before... Right before we're, you know, about to stream, like, an hour or two, a couple hours, and then he does, you know, as late as you guys want. Right? I mean, if, if people are breaking, he's here late. If people aren't breaking, then he's probably done at midnight, you know? So as long as you guys keep him breaking, for sure. Oh, there is for MLB trouts, yeah. Well, see, that's the thing. I think MLB is a little different because... I mean, you have to have physical talent, for sure, right? But you got to think about it. Like, how about that kid at, like, the fair, right? Wasn't he throwing, like, 96, 97 on a... Like a radar, like kind of throw at the fair, and they ended up signing him to like a little minor league deal. I mean, not to say that pitching fast is a hard thing to do, but you know, what I'm saying is that like if you can throw hard or you can showcase that you can hit the ball, I mean, I think you have a better shot at making it in the MLB. Well, not in the MLB, but just making it into a farm system. Their car. Yeah, I've been noticing that Phil Hughes has been coming in super late night with us. I mean, I think he streams too daily, doesn't he? So once he's done with his stream, he just comes over here. And AJ Dillon. $3.99. Yeah, I mean, it is. I mean, I played baseball in high school, and I mean, I'm not saying I threw 90, but I threw like in the mid 80s I'm not even kidding I thought that was great I just really it was really I really didn't have much control like I throw some strikes but not too much but I never really followed up with it I mean I didn't really want to be a pitcher but I actually had a pretty strong arm so they wanted me to become one but I just I just really didn't want to do it David Johnson, Darren Waller, J.K. Dobbins. And then I could throw a pretty nice curveball. It was just one of those slow curveballs that, like, if you timed it, you were good, you know? But, I mean, throwing in the 80s and then throwing, like, a, I don't know, a 60 or less than that, like, curveball. Like, after a while, you time it. Triple Relic, Tyler Boyd, 249. I know, Ace. I mean, I, I probably could have been in the MLB right now. You guys could have been pulling me. Lamar Jackson. But, you know, I played high school sports. It was fun for me. I, I, I love it so much. But I, I kind of knew that <laughs> this was more of a probably just an high school kind of deal. Enjoy it. Like, I wasn't going to chase these things that I knew I probably wasn't physically able to do. Grand Delpit to 35. The only, the only, like, ever, like, small offer I ever got was to play, like, tight end at, like, a junior college nearby. Like, football. They wanted me to be a tight end. But I just...
just didn't want to. Like, I, I couldn't even, like, I, you couldn't even get a job. Like, you had to just be committed to just straight up football all day and, like, obviously your studies. But, I mean, I needed to work. <laughs> I needed to get some money in my pocket. I was like, yeah, bro, uh, I kind of need to work. All right, next one. Of course, Frank. I keep on telling, I keep on telling the Jazzy crew, like, if we can, I, I want us to have like a softball team or something like that. I would love to do that. Like, have a little softball beer league. It should be awesome. I played in a couple of softball leagues after high school with my cousins. I mean, I wasn't really drinking as much as they were. I was just kind of having fun playing softball. But I would definitely love to do something, something like that. I mean, I don't know if we can all do basketball league. That's kind of a little too much cardiovascular fitness for all of us, probably. But uh, I definitely tell everybody we have enough players for like a softball team. That'd be cool. Sam Darnold, Jared Stidham, and Brandon Ayuk to 30. Um, no, Brosy is not sold out yet, man. Down to 16 0, I believe. 37 out of 49. Devin DuVarnay. Rob Gronkowski to one hundred. You got Derek Henry. Denzel Mims to 199 and Jonathan Taylor triple relic and auto there you go Colts Jason with that one I'm sure we'll do something with that though, Frank. I mean, I'm sure we'll put like a little yeah. promo or we'll do a little filler or something. I think it was, I think it, not that it won't fill quickly. I mean, it's just there's so many new baseball releases and new, new releases in general this week, which would love to have got that done before yesterday, you know, you know, Benjamin, but we'll fill it up, man. And it'll be glorious because people that stuck around and waited for it are going to get some monster hits. And you got a little Dan Marino fantasy flashbacks, 24 out of 50. Right, two more boxes, guys.
Graham Delpit. We got Saquon Barkley. Keenan Allen. A little Jalen Hurts. 30 out of 199 for the Eagles. And Gabriel Davis. This has actually become a pretty strong rookie. Receiver for the Buffalo Bills. Boom. You get a kaboom. T. Higgins, introductions. And out of 25, Devin DuVarnay took a kickoff return to the house, right? Last Monday night. Ravens. It's going to Ryan Redman. And Denzel Mims to 189. Jets going to William. Alrighty, guys. Last box before, or last pack before the last box. Justin Jefferson. DK Metcalf, Tools of the Trade, out of 49. Very nice. Seahawks going to Patrick. There you go, Pat. Christian McCaffrey out of 75. Good luck. Again, if no kaboom right here, I don't know. I, I don't know. Are they case hits? I don't know if, if this is if the kabooms are a case hit. I assume that they are, but no kaboom here, guys. The second half inner for random teams number two has been posted. So, I'm always run that back and see if we can get a nice kaboom. Also, guys, we have these available for personal boxes. I'll be going live at two o'clock. I believe we have these for two thirty nine ninety nine as personals. Uh, we also have Triple Threats Personals, and I don't think we have any Heritage Minor League breaks posted up here, but we do have those available as personal boxes today as well with me. So it's going to be very, very busy on Instagram today, so buy your boxes and get in line, guys. It should be fun. Jaspies.com. I was here breaking until like 1.30 in the morning yesterday. From 2 to 1.30, I was like, wow, almost 12 hours. <laughs> Uh, we do, Ace. We actually have quite a few personal boxes of Sapphire. Those are $500 a box. You can check it out on Instagram and buy it on jazpies.com. Steven Montes. Out of 199 That is for the Washington football team. And Buccaneers. So Chris Godwin, Tyler Johnson, Team Tandems. Yeah. I mean, like I said, there's two type of customers I would say, right? One is they rather get something in return rather than risking a fraction of the price, right? And not getting anything. And, um, you know, that's works best. We have the best of both worlds, guys. You know, we, we offer personal boxes or people that want to buy a whole box for themselves or the group breaking side. That is the beauty of it. And Jordan Love. Very nice. 12 out of 50. Little Jay Hart for the Green Bay Packers going to Ryan Redman. And wow, I don't even notice this. Look at that. 101 Groundhogs. Joe Mixon. Woo, little players tag right there. Bengals, that's going to Danny. Oh, no. Of course not, Deep Porter. I mean, at the same time, I mean, it, that's everywhere. I mean, someone could be a high roller and taking the Bengals in every pick your team. And then someone's a high roller buying a whole box. I mean, it ends up being the same thing, really. But someone rather just, of course, 
take that, I guess, smaller risk, right, as getting a whole box than, than potentially spending, you know, however much the Bengals cost on a bigger team or something and get nothing. Austin Eckler, Adam Thielen, Jermichael Hasty, and Justin Jefferson. There you go for the Rams. That is going to Sean. Alrighty, and there you go, guys. Very, very nice. Oh, Van Jefferson, sorry. I don't know why I thought of Justin. But there you go, guys. A little one-on-one -on -one tag there. Jordan Love. I think early on we got a Herbert in here. All right. Ayuk. Actually, some good rookie names in here, though. Unfortunately, no Burrow or Tua. But, like I said, there's that Herbert right there to 149. 23 out of 149. So appreciate it, guys. Again, the next half is in the store. Uh, round scene number two, jazbeescasebreaks.com.